Hey guys, it's James and Chris again from Alpha 7 Energy. We're uh, heading back to Oklahoma. Uh, this is going to be a big day for us. The ASC 1 and ASC 2 wells are, are pumping and the ASC 3 just started drilling yesterday. So we're going to see what we've got with the ASC 3 and hopefully get some great footage of the other wells. It's a little rainy here in Dallas, but it should be clear once we make it to Oklahoma. So fingers crossed. Stay tuned. All right, so this is the site of the ASC-1. Uh, the pump jack on the ASC-1, as you can see behind me, is quite a bit smaller than the one on the ASC-2, but they've both been painted. Uh, this this uh, pump jack did have some issues with a downhole pump, which uh, were addressed earlier this week. Uh, there's a new pump installed and it is back online. So we're very excited. Both wells are finally pumping. Uh, we're going to wait until we have some solid initial production numbers uh, to report. But both wells are online and I'm going to show you a little bit more around the lease. Uh, in front of me we've got the uh, tank batteries. So actually let me just spin around. So we've got the tank batteries and the uh, separator which is that vertical uh, black structure behind me. And these tank batteries are what's going to be holding all of the uh, the oil that we extract from the wells until uh, the trucks can come by and haul off the oil. So Seminole County Phase One is nearing completion, and needless to say, we're uh, everyone here at ASE and all of our partners. We're all very excited to see how these wells do. So stay tuned. There's going to be more to show. Hey everyone, James again. I'm at the site of the ASC2 well. As you can see, the pump jack behind me is on and it is pumping. We've got our Alpha 7 Energy logo on there. It's a tiny one for now, but we're gonna replace that soon with a larger one. This well just started pumping recently, uh, along with the ASC1. Uh, we're gonna give it some time. It takes a little time for it to, uh, to pump out significant amounts of oil. We're gonna keep pumping, pulling out fluid until the cut of oil gets larger and larger and we start pulling out less water. Uh, once, once we've pulled out most, if not all of the water, then we're gonna to start to see our, our first initial production figures and that'll be an exciting day. So stick with us. Uh, we're gonna be driving around the lease and I'm gonna show you a little bit more. All right, we're back at the ASC2. We're gonna be pulling a little sample. Let's see what we got. There it is. It kind of looks like coffee, doesn't it? I'm gonna zoom in. There you go. This is still the water from what we used when we're drilling, so we still gotta get all that out first before we start seeing a better oil cut. Mm -hmm. And you can kind of see the oil cut we have forming on the top. There it is. So 
just so everyone back home can see the scale and size of this pump jack, there it is with Chris standing next to it. This pump jack is absolutely massive. It dwarfs even the one we have on the ASC-1. Hey everyone, we are at the site of the ASC-3. Right there behind me, you can see that's the uh, rig that has begun uh, drilling this well. It began drilling, I believe, two days ago. So it would have been on Tuesday of this week. Uh, the BDW650, that is the uh, make and model of the rig. This is one of two rigs that Alpha 7 now owns, the other one being the Draco 133 which is off-site and is being uh, cleaned and painted currently. So this rig is drilling our ASC-3. It's very likely going to be used to drill several other wells on this lease here in Seminole County. And soon this, will, uh, this rig will be painted as well. We're gonna throw on the uh, US, Aussie, and uh, Oklahoma flags on there as well. So stay tuned. Uh, we're gonna show you a little bit more around the lease.